go to create new and remember that you have to capture your video in the portrait mode of your mobile screen so just uh, drag this one here up to this place import area okay this is a short video and here uh, you see that this option here original drag it here up to this place and now the size you can see that I can change the size because it's on my timeline you just need to go there and then select 916 this is the show actually YouTube and TikTok video size so if I remove here you see this is black area this is my area where I'm gonna work so if this is not fixed just pinch it to this place for example I just wanna drag it here and now just make it smaller or bigger you can see and now this is the area but I don't need this one so press Control Z and this is the actual shape so if you want to do further editing you can add text here you just click on the video and then text here and then you will see an option here to auto captions as well here auto captions and now you create and CapCut is gonna create auto captions for you so you can edit those captions as well let's wait okay these dots you can see that there are captions you just move your cursor here and you see this is a very tiny caption is written there so you just grab it like this one and now what you need to do the first one you see here in this section uh, this is the text here and I need to change the color first let's suppose it's black because I'm wearing white shirt so it would be black or red is fine so red and then I just make this text only this text as black okay so <clears throat> this one is done and you can also add some animations here here you can see these are the animations and I just select this animation yeah and now I'm gonna mute this one here because I'm capturing this video here audio go to this one and mute this one and now you see the captions are here so I'm gonna play this video here look everything is fine okay once you are done if the text is extra or maybe like it's, it's bigger it doesn't fit on the screen so you can just click on this area and enter here and the text would be all right so you just go there you see now the text is fine and you just need to do this kind of settings so you can also make bold italic and underline text or italic and bold so like this one so I want to change the P for this one is capital now so you can also give some stroke like this one that's awesome and you can change the font as well in the stroke section you can give the stroke and then you just go to the start again uh, for example like this one I'm gonna give uh, it a stroke okay this one and I just select this area and go to this uh, stroke option here this is justified in the center and after changing the color you just go to stroke area and you can select this color as well and this one you see stroke color as well I think like this one looks okay as you can see here this is stroke area so you can also change position and this stroke color as well thickness of this one and border you can also give some borders like this one it's a black or any other color you can choose and it will appear like that in this one so let's not give any color I'm just uh, sorry I just don't want to give any color here just remove this one here 
white. That's fine. Uh, stroke is okay, but this border you don't need this one. So that's fine. This is easy. And if you want to just give this kind of bubbles here, for example, I use this one, and this would be a this will appear like this one. Okay, but I don't need this one. I just click cancel and that's all. So in effect section, you can give some more effects <clears throat> like this, this one. For example, this is okay, this one art. And if I export the project now, it's done. If I export and I just give the volume again here and now export the project, you will see that this is a, I just say, short video, uh, test short, I can see. All right, so I'm gonna save it to my desktop screen. All right and 4k is hd and 35 or 30 frame rate frame per second and okay that's all right export the product now and for some time because it's gonna create and export the project all right it's done and now i press ok close this one and now i go to my desktop here uh sorry here this one as you can see this is the test shot and i i realized six things in my life never tell your weaknesses to anybody never tell your uh, failures to anybody never tell your plans okay you can see that these captions are already there so this is how you can easily make captions i just gave it my, some borders or something i didn't check um, before exporting so this is how you can easily caption as well and create a YouTube short if you like the video thumbs up subscribe and uh, share among your friends I really know, need your support and see you next time in another video bye bye